Yo, what's up? It's your boy Dragon back for another tutorial, man. And I know y'all been seeing me with this same black shirt on. Do not think I'm nasty, bro. I'm just trying to get a lot of videos recorded before my nephew get back home. Alright, so in today's, well, yeah, it's the same day. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to make our real layer styles. And obviously, I'm going to drop the um the template down below so I can help y'all out. Feel me? Do not be calling me stink in the comment section, bro. It's the same day. <laughs> you feel me? But yeah, let's get straight to it. First thing I want to do is go to Photoshop. Now, if, obviously, the first thing I'm going to do is show you how to use it. So let me go find the file. All right, so when you first open the um, layer style file, it's kind of like any other pack you had. These like layer styles right here, the top one. You obviously I put a north for a reason. Don't go down there and mess with them. But to copy a layer style, you just want to go to file, new, 12 video. I'm going to show you how to make them too. I'm, I'm going to give you the template and I'm going to show you how to make them if you ever want to make your own. This is my favorite one right here. I don't know why I just like these gray ones. But I'm going to right click, copy layer style, go on new one. I'm going to just type um, GG. And however big or small you make it, it changes like the way the layer style look. And I learned that over the time of like designing or whatever, even though I ain't been designing that long. But say if I make this big, it's going to change the gradient on it. But if I make this very small, you can see the gradient, it changed again. So I'm, I'm going to show you what I mean. So let me just put some on here. I'm going to put on uh, dragon, right? And I'm going to show you how I make the little effect with it too. So we're not really going to really worry about the gradient right now. We just worrying about a layer style. I'm gonna put a black background back here. Hit G on my keyboard and just do that real quick. Well, not actually. I'm gonna put like um this color background. All right, so we got the background right, and we already stay. I already told y'all like how it changed or whatever. So basically, to get a layer style looking good, we just gonna and I'm gonna show you how I make my stuff. I click on that. I go to warp, and I put me a little arc on it. And I do this for a lot, like a lot of times. I just do this. I just drag this right here. And I'll hit Control J, and when I hit the Control J, I just put another layer style below it, and that's basically how I do the layer style or whatever. I just kind of put it to where it's like right there. Now to make your own layer style, I'm gonna show you. Them. They probably want the best example. I ain't gonna lie, that that did not look good. But I'm just showing you how. Cause I got a whole tutorial talking about it, bro. I so <laughs> I will show you how to make your own. You feel me? It's gonna it's real simple. Now I'm gonna put GG. Um. Nah, I ain't, I ain't feeling GG. I'm gonna put um. Put LOL or something. Feel me? I'm gonna right click, blend options. Like I said, I'm showing you how to make it. Grainy OLED. I don't know why this on color dodge. I do not know. All right, so this is the bottom. The left side is the bottom. So I already forgot, but I think I think the bottom is like the darker color or something. And then like the top is the lighter color. I might be wrong, but you want to do something like this. Obviously, you want to add drop shadow. Drop shadow is just up to you how you want to do it. Feel me? And then you want to add an inner shadow like this right here. Now I see some people add some some of this to it too. I ain't even gonna try to pronounce it, but I'm not really that familiar with this right here. But I kind of know how to use it. Some people add this. Make it look a little bit better. Essentially, sneak DF. I ain't even trying to copy off. He not even DF no more. I'm just say sneak. Feel me? Cause he like he put me on this right here. But yeah, he be using this. Feel me? And like I say, some people I think they just do darker at the bottom, brighter at the top. You feel me? You know what it is. But yeah, that's basically how you make the art. Right, that's how that's how I made the lyric style. Like, cause I like I made these lyric style. This is exactly how I made every single one of them. But yeah, if this video helped you out, feel me? Hey, like the video, you feel me? That would be appreciated. I'm just going to blend the options on here real quick to see how I made this because I might do something wrong. Yeah, that's how I did that. Dark at the bottom, bright at the top. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you drop a like, subscribe. Me and Boy Dragon, peace out. You're going to see about five more videos with this same black shirt on. So get used to it.